Well, I hope you guys had a good Christmas because I was plain boring sick. If you remember when I was lying down in my sister's room? Yeah, that was definitely the start of something. But I am feeling a whole lot better today. Like a lot of people, Christmas to me is a time of indulgence. Like most years, I ate a lot of food. And I drank a lot of tea. And obviously with all that extra caffeine, I've been absolutely smashing the gym. Jack, are you ready to go to the gym? I don't need an answer, he's always ready. I'm back from the gym and Jack is off to Dublin. Training after being sick, I generally don't see a problem with it. It leaves you pretty wrecked, but you can always push through. Christmas is officially over. My sister's leaving. Why are you leaving? Oh, you look so cool, Rachel. You should go back to Galway. No one wants you here anymore. <laughs> okay, come by. Cheerio. Cheerio. I'm going to Galway because I think she's an Indian. Yay, I love Yay. Indian. I think we must be having one tonight. Dirty girl. Bye. Goodbye, Rachel. Cheerio. Both my siblings have left me now. Now what am I meant to do? How am I meant to entertain myself? Max? Max? Max, I see you. I know you're in there. Even my lizard, who I keep trapped in a cage, is trying to leave me. And it's just when I've gotten better and actually want to do stuff. I guess I'll just sit down and watch a movie or something. Okay, well, I watched half a movie. So something I did have planned for today's vlog, I have now completely gone against and don't want to do it. Yesterday, I made a vlog looking at this. Looking at this new microphone I have on my DSLR. And today, what I wanted to do was, in some ways, tell the story of the camera itself. And really, that just means showing you a video I had made Basically my first vlog on this camera. So if any of you are interested in the creative aspect of uh, making a vlog or just the behind the scenes of making a vlog or if you can get better at vlogging then this video might actually answer some of your questions because definitely I have gotten better. So you may have heard that I did this stuff for six months. But before I went off and did any kind of traveling, I had made a vlog in Ireland. Though it's of something quite cool, which is an abandoned quarry in Ireland, it's somewhat cringy to watch. Not that I'm that bad at it, but like, it's just definitely not the same way I do things now. So we're gonna watch it now, and if it's cool, that's great. If not, we can just laugh at it. And actually, if you think it's any good at all, then I am sure I might even release it, the full video. All right, I'm just gonna pull up the video. Now. I just got a new camera. So let's see the difference in quality in three, two, one. That is a whole lot better. Okay, so one thing, first of all, is I look incredibly different. Uh, I'm actually clean shaven. I've got glasses that my uh, travel buddy called Gimpy. This is Matthew, he's the muscle today. A big thing here is I'm not even looking into the camera. Like that's, oh here we go. We're going to a secret location in Ireland. I am looking into the camera. You ready to explore the mystique of this place? Wind. Like I said, wind is a really big problem when it comes to vlogging sometimes, so that's why I have this new microphone and I had a little vlog of that yesterday. Okay, it's my go. Hips are going. Oh, the wind is horrible. Oh, I remember this. This time. <laughs> I think I was just slightly, sl ever so slightly, too big to squeeze through there. Hips are through. It's a vlog of me for 30 seconds straight just trying to get through a gate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is well over 30 seconds of me trying to get through a gate. There's a microwave if anyone wants one. Okay, I think it's time to tell you where we are. Yeah, there's some nice shots going on, all right. And there's the foreboding tunnel. Ooh, the foreboding tunnel. 
some nice shots. You have to give it to me. Yeah, uh, yeah. All right. Look, it's uh, it's 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 old and uh, it's in a completely different style, and I mightn't be as charismatic, but that's pretty much my first proper vlog so um, if you guys actually do want to see it then please comment in the comment section because if no one comments then I'm definitely not putting it up but if you comment I'll do it why not so let this just in some ways be a lesson that I guess vlogging can be learned uh, that you can get more comfortable in front of the camera and like my main aim when I very when I first started doing any kind of vlogs and putting the camera in front of me was simply to get more comfortable in front of a camera my that was my aim just simply because I was a terrible actor and me and my friend Niall would always make like kind of silly little uh, short movies and things like that and I just anytime I, I was just terrible just plain crap um, and this is a really good motivating factor to actually sort of face that uncomfortableness sometimes you feel in front of a camera and uh, try and get better with it so if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see the full I'll edit it properly this time, the full video of my first vlog, um, then please leave a like rating, subscribe if you're new, and if you want some more, if you're hungry for more, um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.